Hi, it's Alaska Granny. I'm a huge fan of master built smokers. I had one for many years that had a digital control on the top and I started having problems with that so I got rid of it. I ordered just a plain old analog master built smoker. It's less expensive and it just has a simple dial temperature but it also has the thermometer on the front. It has all the components for basic smoking and I've really been enjoying using this basic master built smoker just as much as the previous smoker that I had. Let me show you today I have an easy recipe for how to smoke a whole chicken with a rotisserie dry rub seasoning on it. It's so simple. You just need a few simple dry rub ingredients, a whole chicken, and a smoker, and there you go. You can see this chicken was $2.09 a pound. It's a six pound chicken for $12.92, but it was a bargain. Buy one, get one free. Rotisserie chicken seasoning mix combines parsley, onion powder, paprika, salt, pepper, garlic powder, and thyme. So into a dish, measure one tablespoon of parsley, one tablespoon of onion powder, one tablespoon of paprika, a half a tablespoon of salt, one half tablespoon of pepper, one half tablespoon of garlic powder, and one teaspoon of thyme. Then you can stir them together and if you like put them into a shaker but make sure that your shaker has big enough holes that the seasonings will fit through the holes because parsley for example is larger uh, size particles than other types of seasonings. Make sure you remove any excess packaging and reach inside for any parts that are in the cavity. Sometimes they're in a packet and sometimes they're in there loose. And now we're ready to sprinkle the chicken with our seasoning mix. Now I've rinsed it, patted it to dry, made sure there's nothing left in the cavities. And I'm gonna start with a sprinkle into the cavity. Both ends. And I'm going to sprinkle it liberally all over the chicken. You want to make sure that you get under the legs, under the wings, all over the front and the back. Just keep sprinkling at every little nook and cranny of your whole chicken. I think that about does it. Now you want to take your wings and you want to tuck the little tips under so just fold them down and tuck them under both wings fold them and tuck them under don't worry if they crunch a little bit okay And our chicken is ready to go into the smoker. One of the things that I do when I'm setting up my smoker, I put a little aluminum tray into the water tray to help make it clean up better. I load up my chips and then I put a little piece of foil over the wood chip lid simply because it drips a lot and it's inconvenient to have to clean it up. And just putting a little piece of foil over the top of the chip tray doesn't affect the a way that the food is being smoked. Preheat your smoker on high for about 20 to 30 minutes to make sure it gets nice and warm. I want to smoke my chicken about 225, 250, somewhere in there, and it needs to go for four to six hours. It all depends on your outside temperature, the size of your chicken, and it, like if it's windy, today it's windy, it could make a difference. So the weather outside is going to make a bit of a difference. The colder it is, the longer it takes. So keep an eye on your chicken, keep your thermometer handy, and check it every few hours until it comes up to the temperature that you want. If you have a probe that you can put in it to measure the temperature without opening the smoker, that's ideal. It's registering about 250, so I'm going to go ahead, open it up, place the chicken on the middle rack, 
close it up and then try to adjust the temperature possibly down to medium to help it go around 225 degrees. Stay back when you open it. I got smoke right in my eyes. <laughs> You want to smoke your chicken until the internal temperature of the thickest part of the meat without touching the bone reaches 165 degrees. Then you want to take your chicken out, set it aside to rest for about 30 minutes, and then it's going to be delicious. For about 30 minutes. Tender, moist, juicy, smoky, delicious. A whole chicken smoked in the Masterbuilt Smoker with the rotisserie rub is absolutely delicious, tender, moist, and yummy. The length of time that you need to smoke your chicken definitely will depend on the size of it. So the larger it is, the longer it will take. This six pound chicken took about six hours at 225 degrees and it's absolutely delicious. If you enjoyed my video, I hope you'll share it with someone else you think might like it. Please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel.